Hello everyone and welcome back to Britain Walder. Now, last time we took care of the Red Ed who were over here and I believe they are just about to become dissolved any moment now actually because I noticed some of their vassals were joining other factions as I was on my way to Loidis, which I believe will potentially be our next conquest which is actually owned at the moment by the Pengwern. They've been at war with us for rather a considerable portion of this series and I would like to take them out as quickly as I can as they own a rather considerable portion of the Midlands. Well, I suppose I could call them the Midlands at the moment. <laughs> so yes, there they are. That is their entire territory and they actually stretched a bit up to Benatia territory as well. So I'm hoping maybe I can take this particular fief here and maybe release that prisoner who just happens to be residing in their dungeon. Oh yes. So let's prepare our ladders and start this going. Hopefully a few vassals may turn up and we can take them out and perhaps even take them prisoner. That would be really nice. Okay, so let's see. Oh. Yes, I believe that will give us some morale. Yes, very nice. Okay. Oh, this has actually been besieged by someone of Peng Wern. Oh, well, that is a coincidence, isn't it? Okay, so we're going to continue here for now. And I believe after this, we will then rush very quickly over here and try to prevent them from taking it from us. Now, I do know that Lady Inca was around here, so maybe she will intercept them. I can only hope that is the case at least. Oh, okay, perhaps not. They were a lot quicker than we were to actually take that. Okay, after we take this, we will rush very quickly and attempt to mount a retaliatory strike against the Pengwern for taking one of our towns, or should I say newly conquered towns. Yes, okay, so we have my new sword and between recordings, I actually went over to Aleach and raised the tax rates on some of the towns and castles and villages. Not all of them, mind you, because I don't really want to lose relation with them, because I believe if you raise them to very high status, they do start to lose relation with you, but it has made quite a significant difference in my financial situation, apart from obviously me selling prisoners, which is my majority income at the moment. Speaking of prisoners, I haven't actually sold my current prisoners. I neglected to do that before I started the recording, unfortunately, but maybe once we head back to take the thief that was just snatched from under us by the Pengwern, Perhaps we'll find a ransom broker there and we'll be able to take this guy's shield out. <laughs> no, well, take those prisoners and perhaps sell them. That would be a really nice thing. Now, the only problem with going on this ladder is... Oh my. Yes, that is potentially the issue. But apart from that is the fact that... Wow, there's actually a lot of units here. But as I was saying, is that... There are a lot more enemies on that side compared to this right ladder here. I'm actually moving our forces back a little bit so I can get in. That would be nice. Okay, so get ready and charge in again now. Thank you very much. Oh my. Don't get headshot, Barney. Come on. Make sure your shield is raised. Yes. Okay, let's go back in. And hopefully not get completely decimated. Oh, no, no, okay. There we go. Thank you very much for ignoring me completely. That is lovely. Oh my goodness. Whoa, okay. That was quite some splash, wouldn't you say? Oh yes, I would. <laughs> okay. Come on. Let's just do some special hits here. Maybe take out a few heavier units. And then we will hopefully assist our units in actually taking this for once, rather than getting knocked out, as usual. As that is usually what attempts to happen to me. Come on. Take him down. Oh, no. How dare you? Are you a elite skirmisher? I think he might be. He seems rather fancy. Oh, never mind. Okay, he's just a heavy infantry. 
Well, what can I expect? I suppose heavy infantry is rather heavy. They did take quite a while to die. How unfortunate. Now, let's go on the side. No, I'm not going to go on the side. That is a bad idea, isn't it? Yeah, that would probably be my death. Oh, yes. Now we've got my spear out. I'm doing some really serious damage here. Oh, yes. I'm liking this. Come on. Take them out, Barney. Yeah. Okay, they have... Okay, so the enemy has now received reinforcements. So we're going to have to deal with those as well. There aren't actually that many forces here. Or from what I could tell, at least. Only around 200 or maybe 300. But that was a lot better prospect than the other thieves that I had actually scouted. What? Oh my goodness. Okay, so I just got taken out with 14 damage and 17 damage. That was somewhat upsetting. Hmm. I am not entirely sure how they did that. Okay. Well, that teaches me for talking and not actually noticing my HP, doesn't it? I assumed that they wouldn't take me out that fast, considering I had quite a lot of my units are surrounding me. Oh well. Okay, I believe we are going to win any time now though, so I am hoping our units will clear out these two bottlenecks that are coming up and then dispatch our foes on the other side. Yes. Okay, come on guys, let's do it. Yeah, I don't think they're actually going to receive any more reinforcements, or at least I can hope that they're not, because if they do, they oh. <laughs> really? We haven't killed that many yet? Okay. Or have we? Maybe this is the last wave. Oh, they actually spawned in this little building here. Oh my goodness, yeah, there's actually quite a lot. Yeah, I would retreat right now, but the siege ladders take 42 hours to actually build, and I don't want the Penguin to hold on to our town for longer than we have to. Let them have it, at least. Okay, so they only have a lot of skirmishes down here now, so our infantry should be able to very easily overwhelm them. What are these guys doing? Look, they're just standing here. How dare you? Get down there and fight. There's actually another staircase they could go down. Right here. <laughs> I suppose the AI is a little bit... balked. In this particular case, at least. Yeah, those couple of guys are... Oh, they're actually targeting that man over there. These two guys, aren't they? <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, I believe the AI doesn't actually realize there is a walkway here. And they are just bugged looking at these three men. Because, as you can see, this guy is just running into the wall as we speak, too. So... Yeah, I don't think it's going well for either AI sides. Oh, never mind. Okay, they appear to be bowmen. Oh, well, that's rather irritating. Oh, never mind. Okay. Good work, Light Cavalry. I believe they took out that particular fellow with their throwing weapons. Very nice job, I must say. Oh, I should really watch out for my health next time. I wanted to survive a lot longer than this. That was disappointing. Okay, well, let's just go and check out what's going on here, and if we're not moving, I may indeed cut away, because this is taking quite a long time, and I would like to head on to our previous fief that was just taken from us. So... Mm, I'm not entirely... Yeah, okay. Yeah, I will cut away, and once my forces have reached the top of these stairs, or should I say, around the middle of the stairs, yeah. I will cut back. Okay, so they haven't actually reached the middle of the stairs just yet, but 
the AI has decided to walk down the opposite staircase. So we are really, really happy about that. And as you can see, they are decimating the enemy's forces down below while our higher forces take out the enemy on top of the stairs. Oh, yes. On the opposite side. So I'm hoping these guys won't all get taken out because, as you can see, they are outnumbered. So I'm hoping that these guys will be done soon. Come on, guys. What are they chasing after? One guy? <laughs> okay. Yes, I believe that is it. And we are victorious in taking Loidis from the Penguin. And there is actually just one missile unit behind here. And he is going down. Oh, there's another one as well, apparently. Why are you hiding in the stables? This is no place for the likes of you. Yes. Wow, look at this. There's actually got a window over here. That's cool. Look at that. It's a shame you can't shoot out of it, but still. <laughs> okay, I believe that is the last enemy to be taken out, and there we are. We have attained victory. And as you can see, we did actually suffer a hell of a lot of casualties. 62 of our own forces were killed in that last engagement. That is very disappointing, to say the least. And we have freed this particular vassal, who is actually affiliated with Bonaccia. Oh yeah. Okay, so that's very nice. Now we get to take a lot of rescued prisoners. Oh yeah, I am so happy about this. As you can see, I did lose a lot of my own troops in that last battle. Yes, old hero. Very nice. Was this actually where I was defeated before? <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. Huh. Because I didn't think the AI could recruit old heroes. So, yeah. That's actually rather interesting. Okay. So, yeah, I won't actually take the missile units just yet. If I do indeed lose a few more units in the next engagement, I may resort to taking missile units. But for now, we are just going to conquer it and give it to Lady Inca as she lost the other one. So there we go. We will add 1,000 to the treasury. We will head to the marketplace very fast and sell all of the loot we acquired for a little cash injection. Oh yeah. So let's get some butter, dried meat, sausages, grain, and lots of bread. Oh yeah. Wow. They have a lot of bread here. Very nice. 